I am currently 62 minutes and 45 minutes into my fast. Let's take a screenshot. Boop. I think I got 62.45. We did. It's on the screen there. And I'm still feeling good. This morning, I ended up having some electrolytes. So yesterday, I didn't have any electrolytes because I just didn't feel like it. But this morning, I woke up hungry. So I was like, I'm going to have some electrolytes. Had some electrolytes. Ice. Like when I have that one cup of electrolytes with element, I'm sipping it for hours. I'm not drinking that in one shot. It takes me a while to finish it up. So yeah, I'm just sipping that away. I should probably have regular water because I am thirsty. But right now it is 12 56 p.m or 46 p.m i'm about to go to sleep but before i go to sleep um this is like the next day second day that i'm feeling sleepiness but i have to get my glucose monitor my other one which is there all right i've got my other freestyle libre so i am going to test my ketone levels so my glu blood glucose level has been steady it's actually going down but yesterday was like 5.6 today it's at right now it's at 5.3 I would always look at it, but that's a good thing. So that's a shot of my glucose, as you can see. There we go. And now we're going to take um, my blood ketone levels because it's important to do that. I'm running out of ketone strips. I might have to get some. I might order the urine one, but like it's not. The urine one isn't accurate. The most accurate one is this. So why would I waste money on that when I can... They both cost the same thing, like to get a refill. A pack is like 25 and the urine one's like 25. So I might as well get the one that's a little more accurate. So I'm gonna test my blood ketone levels to see where my ketones are. And today, this will be in another future video. If I remember, I'll link it in the art card above. I am going to be meal planning for my keto OMAD meal today and my keto pretty much diet for the next couple weeks now let's give a check-in my knees have been feeling good today um so that's pretty cool that my knees feel great because the reason why i started this fast was because of my knees because i messed up my exercise but um hang on Ooh, this poor finger has been abused let's use another one i hate doing that please get enough blood because i don't want to prick myself multiple times to make sure that's not showing up on camera because I think YouTube has a policy about blood. So I don't want to show any of that. Um, but yeah, my knees are feeling great. So we'll put them to the test tomorrow slightly. Tomorrow will be an upper body day. <laughs> my ketone levels don't move. It's at 0.3. <laughs> Literally 0.3. They don't move. When my ketones level get high, that's when we get, like, that's when we know I'm in ketosis but they literally don't move. Uh, I'm in ketosis right now, it's obvious, because I'm not hungry anymore. But yeah, those are my ketone levels. So I'm gonna put that into the app so I know that's 1.47 p.m. That one says one, it's actually 12, that one's wrong. Let's add a note, ketone level. And I'm using millimoles per liter, just so you guys know. That's the Canadian metric way. In my, <laughs> one of my videos, I said the a US metric cup, wow. Oh my God, can you Americans just come with the rest of the world so it's not confusing and we're all not, you know, because here in Canada, everyone weighs themselves in pounds, but the doctors weigh ours in kilos and then height is also in centimeters. So that's why I know my height in centimeters. But every day when you talk to someone, we say pounds. So Americans got the whole world confused using the British imperial system. Anyway, so there's that. I'm feeling good. I will tell you guys how long I go for the fast. I really want to do 72 hours. I want to get the effect of that. What do you call it? Oh my God. <laughs> what is it called? I need to sleep. That's what it's called. It's called the stem cell reset. Oh my gosh. The immune system reset fast. That's the 72 hour fast because it resets your stem cells, resets your whole immune system. But I feel like there's change happening. I am feeling a bit pain up here. My hip was hurting me, but it's not anymore. So I think there's healing going on. Anyway, I am so excited to take you guys along with this fast. If you are fasting while watching this video, please drop a comment below and let me know what fast are you doing? Are you doing an OMAD fast? Are you doing a 24, your first 24 hour fast? Are you doing a 36 hour fast? Are you doing a 72 hour fast? Are you doing a rolling 72 or rolling 78? Are you doing ADF? 
I said 78. I meant to say 48. <laughs> Are you doing alternate day fasting? Are you doing intermittent fasting? Let me know because fasting heals. Fasting promotes healing. We need to heal our bodies with all the crap that's everywhere. But drop a comment below and let me know. She's always by my side. You look like a wolf today. Like the wolf eyes. Is that the wolf? See? The wolf eyes, the eyebrows. That's a wolf. Now I'm gonna go try to sleep with her here. Why are you so pretty? Is that a bird? Are you a wolf? Sleep time. Boop. My body is having a mental breakdown right now. <laughs> I'm gonna have to break this fast soon. I am getting crazy amount of pain on my right side, which I normally don't get pain on my right side, but there are injuries on the right. It's like my body's like switching like from autophagy like back and forth. We're going to do autophagy on this side, which is like the injured side. And then we're going to do autophagy on that side. Like when one side's injured, guys, like it's both sides because the body works in tandem. So I just saw my neighbor. I'm like, I'm like 65 into, uh, hours into my fast. That's like three days. I'm like, my body is freaking out. So... <laughs> I'm gonna go to Safeway and grab some things. I already have some avocado set, but yeah, anyway, I'm gonna touch base with you guys when I stop driving. All right, I'm probably not gonna take off really. Of course, when I start filming. <laughs> All right, the culprit was found. They stopped their freaking car. Um, what was I saying? Um, I'm not gonna take off these glasses. I probably look crazy right now, but I'm just like gonna like walk into the store and grab what I need to grab. <laughs> I feel absolutely insane right now. I don't want to break my fast yet. I want to like um, Check my ketone levels. Oh, yeah and another reason why I was gonna break the fast like right there and then and then I was like No, I can't no I can't because um, I put on this shirt or this um, pink thing and I'm like it's fitting looser I know I've lost a lot of body fat anyway Let's get to the store because I need to not be in public right now <laughs> Man, buying groceries are out of hand. I was just about to vlog and I dropped $10 out of my pocket and this gentleman like knocked on my car. He's like, oh, you dropped this. I'm like, oh, thank you. <laughs> so sweet of him. Why is it every time I try to vlog here, someone's car goes off? What is going on for the love of God? I need to be at home and I need to stay at home because this place is insane. 
I know, like, what the heck? I don't know if I can, okay. I don't know what's happening. I know car thefts are on the rise in this country because we, I'm not gonna get into that, but Canada got itself in this situation. That's all I gotta say. Anyway, um, <laughs> yeah, grill shoes are out of control. I just got a few things and that was $89. <sighs> that hurt. But um, I guess I'm just gonna have to make everything I have last. And I'm just gonna probably have to eat the same meals for the next couple of days, just making sure that they hit the keto ratios and I should be good. But yeah, anyway, now that I'm moving, I'm feeling a little bit better, I guess. I don't know what happens. When I fast and I start to move around and walk around, I feel infinitely better. Maybe I'll walk bow, we'll see. But right now there's like weird vibes in the air. But that Safeway got renovated, so it's so nice in there. People were like looking at me vlogging, like, oh my God, so annoying. I better get used to this because this is what I want to do. I want to be a content creator and I want to make it like my living, okay? We're going to manifest it into the universe. Content creation is hard, but at least I have control of what I'm doing and everything. But I do want to do this for a living. I do want to be a YouTuber. But um, if I have to like, you know, again, the car. Uh, let's just give up and I'll catch you guys at home. <laughs> All right, I'm back from the store. You guys can see. So I'm gonna try to like stick to everything in my meal plan, but I have a bunch of turkey that I need to eat, so ground turkey, so we're gonna get rid of that. But I'm gonna start cutting up, I'm gonna have this tonight, because this is on my meal plan, but it was on sale at Safeway. Even though things are on sale, things are definitely expensive. So I got a Caesar salad kit, but I'm not gonna use the dressing from here. I am going to use find it there is an organic dressing that i bought i'm gonna use this organic dressing this mother raw caesar dressing of course bow's fur is everywhere okay. then i got some french beans for tomorrow morning yes whipped cream is actually on my meal plan for a hot chocolate so is a zucchini um this is also on my meal plan as well i'll be mixing this with my eggs because i need to make sure i get in a lot of fats this is not on my meal plan, but my meal plan starts tomorrow after I eat like a real meal. This is like my OMAD meal, which I will definitely do another vlog for, which you guys are gonna have to stay tuned for that. If, if you're not subscribed to my channel, subscribe to my channel so you do not miss another video. I'll be doing a keto OMAD vlog after this one. So hit that subscribe button and I'm asking you guys to smash that like button as these acts help me out. Trust me, things have been a lot of OMAD, OMAD lately, but now I'm getting into the rhythm of documenting my journey. So we're gonna go back to doing more vlogs and I'm gonna share with you some results I've been cooking up and share with you everything that has gone on in the last couple months with my weight and everything like that. But anyway, I am going to break, I am actually have a lot of energy right now. So I'm gonna go walk bow, then come home, share my blood ketone results and then take some pictures and then break this fast. Why do I even bother testing my blood ketone levels? Like, I know I have way more than 0.3, way more. I'm full blown ketosis, I'm not even hungry, and it's been almost three days since I've eaten, or it has been three days since I've eaten, but that is my ketone results. But I know I'm in ketosis, I can feel it. So yeah, there you have it. Just tested my blood glucose levels. I might break this fast very soon, guys. We'll see. Like I can keep going. Like I could go till, but I have like an appointment tomorrow morning at 8.30 at the gym. <sighs> we'll see. I'm just gonna listen to my body because it is what it is. If I don't hit the 72 mark, I'm pretty sure I've done tremendous healing. But it's good to know that I can stay in a fasted state like this. When I do that five day fast, I honestly plan on probably going somewhere and just being completely on my own with no responsibilities. Maybe I'll bring Bo, we'll see. But I'll keep you guys updated on when I break my fast, but I'm starting to get, I don't know what it is. I guess, I don't know. Cause I can keep going. I definitely can keep going. I'm just feeling a bit, off i guess i'm already cooking my food <laughs> anyway i gotta go walk this dog all right i'm not sure what happened there but i 
did not properly end the vlog and I went right into my keto OMAD vlog. So you're gonna have to wait until tomorrow to find out how long did I go for my fast. Tomorrow's video will be my keto OMAD vlog. It will be the vlog where I am breaking my fast. So I appreciate you guys joining me for this little fasting series. Um, after the Keto Mad vlog, it will be the results video, and then we'll just get back on track with everything or continue on with my journey. Unfortunately, my continuous glucose monitor fell off. I think it was this morning or the morning before. I'm not happy about it because I spent $100 and it only lasts me like less than a week, and it's supposed to last for two weeks. So I might pick up another one, and I'm going to put it right here. Because when I put it back here with my sports bras and me taking them off and on, um, I guess it fell off. But anyway, if you made it this far into the video, just drop in the word autophagy. And I'm sending you guys mad love. Take care. Bye.